love the channel and find it useful in becoming a happy retiree. Subscribe today. Well, good morning. Welcome back to Money Matters. Right to the phones here, Keith in Greensboro. Keith, good morning. Welcome to the show. What's up? How can I help? Morning, Wes. How are you doing this morning? Good, good. I have a question about uh, IRAs and 401ks. Um, I'm 57. I have two separate simple IRAs from previous employment. I have an individual IRA, and I have a Roth. These are all separate accounts. Got it. And I'm covered under a 401k at my present employer. You are surrounded by retirement plans. That's probably yeah. a, that's a good thing, Keith. Yeah. Um, my question is, I think that the tax benefit would be greater. Uh, let me back up. My CPA said that since I'm covered under an employer-sponsored plan, I cannot make contributions to any of my IRAs. Well, just a, a quick distinction on that. It's not that you can't make contributions. It's just that you can't make deductible contributions. It's probably what he's saying. Yes. Yes, absolutely correct. Um, my question is, I think that the tax benefit would be greater to me if I withdrew from the employer-sponsored 401k plan and then made contributions to my own IRAs. Is that, uh, would that be allowed? Well, I, again, it doesn't save you from, so you're saying you want to pull money. Wait, you're not retired, right? You're still no, working. I'm, no, I'm not retired. I just don't, I just think that this tax benefit if I could take it, make a deductible contribution, the tax benefit would be greater to me than yeah, but, but the, under the 401k. Yeah, but the way the rules, though, work, Keith, it's really, it's it's the fact that you're covered by a plan. It's not that you use it or not use it. It's the fact that you, you, you could use it. And, eligible. You, you're right. You're eligible, okay. and you make a certain amount of money in your case, which obviously your CPA is probably he knows what the level is, and he's saying, look, because you're covered or you're eligible for the plan, and you make X amount, then boom, you are no longer. It, it, it's not an option for you to do that. So you know, there's always this talk of, and Keith, thanks if you're calling your question, but yeah, you you, you can't just withdraw from the 401k in order to then make yourself eligible to do these other deductible contributions. It doesn't work that way. I mean, the good news is here, you've got a lot of different options. You've got 401k, a simple, uh, an, or an, a Roth, and all these other areas to use. Just make sure that you're not trying to get too creative and try to circumvent the tax code. Hi, I'm Wes Moss, and thanks for taking a minute to hear about what's so different about my new book, you can retire sooner than you think. So unlike other retirement books, this book will give you a step-by-step -step guide, whether you're in your 20s or 30s or 40s or 50s, to learn from what these successful and happy retirees did to get there. I hope you enjoy the book, but more importantly, I know that it'll help you retire sooner than you think.